I wanted to ask you this since ages, and this is the right time. You were about ten year old when the first Godfather released. Ten years. Ten, twelve, so. probably. Seventy-three, seventy-three. It released. Yeah, maybe seventeen. Yeah, correct. Yeah. <clears throat> and uh, I wanted to know your fascination with Mario Puzo's classic. On what was yeah. the first time when you saw the first part? What came out? No, no. I say actually the novel came to me first. Okay. Much before uh, the novel, I was in my I think my junior intermediate, uh, and a friend of mine gave the book to me, saying that there's a very hot sex scene in page number twenty six. <laughs> That's how the book came to me. You know? But what happened when you Once saw the movie? Once I read that, okay. First I read the sex scene, and then because I didn't have anything else to do, I read the book, rest of the book, and that changed my life completely. I mean, I'm not the same person ever since. For good, bad, whatever I am. I trace. I can trace it back to the effect of the Godfather book. And what happened when you saw the film the first time? See, film technically, I was not so impressed. I was impressed at certain aspects of it, but it wasn't true to the book, which influenced me. The book has a very strong intensity and very uh, hard-hitting tone in the way the descriptions and everything goes, which is not how Coppola made the film, you know. But for the time, the fact that such under, uh, I mean. Uh, to so much of nuanced performances and all that no one has ever seen a, a film like that to that extent yes you know and uh, so when i made sarkar i always wanted to follow the book stone actually right yeah